that you are finding a way to decide what is unfair, whether you turn the light on or have clean drinking water flow through the taps or have a safe school for the kids to go to. This is what Canadians don't understand. So this is the challenge that's before us. I join uh, Chief Leon in saying that Canadians, we're going to keep reaching out to them. The Allies are, are continuing to jump on board as they understand, I think, in increasing numbers. And I think that effort has to continue, is making sure we educate uh, the Canadian public about the realities. And there's some economic solutions that we have to really look to. The, the, the notion of the certainty that uh, others so desperately thirst from you. Somehow, Chief, you've got to deliver to the rest of the world certainty. That's been, that's been the effort. That's been the focus in, in, in negotiations when the, when the federal governments come to the table. They're trying to extract that sense of certainty. Well, we can offer certainty. That certainty uh, for Canada is if our nations are prosperous, if our children are healthy, well-educated, we've got clean drinking water, if our people are safe and secure in their homes. That's, that's going to provide certainty to British Columbia and to Canada. And so I know the challenges are great, but by way of closing comments, uh, I'll reflect back on those. I, I will be, Mr. Chair and Executive, uh, happy to, uh, to uh, stay as well for further conversations. I am off to Whitehorse to a Habitat for Humanity build on reserve tomorrow. Habitat for Humanity, working with the First Nation to build homes. It's beginning to tell you that Canadians who, who work usually in third world countries are starting to recognize they need to clean up right here in our own backyard, to take care of each other in our own backyard. So it's a long, long journey, but, and it's frustrating at times, but it does feel like we're also making progress on this uh, long journey, and it's a privilege to be engaged in the fight with all of you.